What is going on guys, it's Wava here, and welcome back to some more Blightfall. Now last time we left off, we made more of these uh, mana spreaders, as well as we made these like, what are they called again? They're called uh, endo flames, okay, or end, end of lame. <laughs> but we made these endo flames, and uh, now, or uh, endo flames, geez, I can't get that name right. <laughs> but now we have a pretty decent amount of mana, like, production. Now I know there's like better ways of getting mana, more efficient ways of getting mana, but uh, right now, they're filling up the uh, the mana pools pretty well. I don't know how much mana we need, maybe half a pool to start up the thing, and I don't know how much to keep it uh, keep it running, but I think, uh, I think I want to wait until it's completely full. That one's got about two more pixels until it looks like it's full, like, huh, they're about the same amount of mana in each one of them. Huh, that's good. Anyways. This episode, you know, the last few episodes I've been talking about, hey, I, I kind of want to get some golems to cut down trees and stuff for me, mainly because, you know, I'm tired of coming over here and, you know, cutting down trees, getting wood myself, and because if we do get trees, we can throw them inside the, uh, or we can throw the wood inside the furnace, redstone furnace, get some charcoal, and use that to burn up into mana for our mana pools over here for the Alfheim portal. <laughs> Anyways, let's see, what are we going to need? for some wooden golems. Now, it's been a little while since I made some golems. Uh, oh yeah, I was looking up the, the black lotus. Remember we have these black lotuses over here? Apparently you throw them inside of the uh, mana pool to get some mana, but I don't really want to use them that way, right? Unless I really have to, because it says inside of here that uh, they cannot grow or reproduce. So it looks like you find them in the world, but you can't like make seeds out of them or anything like that you, you can't th get these petals and then put them on the ground and then you know bone meal them and get way more black pet or uh, black lotuses that just don't work apparently so that was really interesting i don't think i'll use them unless i really really need to you know but uh, right now we got a pretty good amount of mana production so real, no real need to use that anyways go back to this uh well that's the wrong book that's batania we need to go to our oh classic oh with hamadamakan because it's been a little while since we've done any golem and see. So let's go over here, let's see. Wood and golem, so we need great wood log, four humanus, four modus, four spiritus. Now we're probably gonna need, I don't know, two, two golems? Okay, so there's humanus. So we're gonna need four and then another four, because like I said, two golems. What else are we gonna need? Spiritus and modus, okay. Let's see if we have any modus, metallum, machina, oh, there's four spiritus right there. Volatus, Ordo, Machina, mmm. Where is the Modus one at? I should have some, right? That's what you get from the, uh, from the trap door? I don't remember. Anyways, let's just check. What do we get Modus from? Let's see. What do you get Modus and what do you get Spiritus from? That way, we get uh, the extra Spiritus we're going to need for the second golem. Because we have enough for one golem right now. But not enough for a second one. So we're Spiritus S. S for Spiritus. We get it from... Looks like zombie heads and stuff. Soul sand and heads. Do I have any heads? Skull. <gasps> Ooh. I've got a skelly skull. Noise. So I should be able to throw that inside of here. Get it to crystallize. And get ourselves some more uh, some more stuff. So there's that. Let's go back to the Thalmanomicon. And let's see how we get the modus. So where is M-O modus? There it is. Yeah, trapdoor. Hmm. Or piston. I can get uh, four of them from it. Okay, let's go make a piston, actually. Let's go over to our ME terminal, make it auto craft for us, and we'll have enough for the next modus thing. Anyways, there you go. Uh, I wonder if the. No, I don't think the sticky piston would get you anymore. There you go. There's a piston. Ah, you know what? Let's get a couple of these. That way we have some modus here for the future. Six pistons, that should get us, what, 6,424 of these? I should get a pretty good amount of golems here in the future. Plus, I did have a uh, aluminium or whatever it's called, so <laughs> might as well use it. Uh, I think that might have been our last one, right? Yeah, I don't think we have any more aluminium. I'm going to have to make some more if I want some. Anyways, looks like uh, the crystallizer over here are working. Uh, let's see if we have any orum alienus. Blah, blah, blah. Where is the hu... Not humanus. Oh, did I just pick it up? Oh, there it is right there. Spiritus. Noise. Spiritus. Look at that. Looks like some sort of examinus. Yeah, let's give some examinus too. Okay, so there's the four spiritus. Or the, yeah, yeah, the four extra spiritus that we're going to need. And now, I guess we're just going to have to wait for the, uh, Sheena, blah, blah, blah. There's that one. 
Yeah, there's toll, my God, 23 modus. Sheesh, that's an absolute ton. Oh, man. Can I empty this? Because I don't want that grave one. I don't want to wait. Okay, whatever, whatever. <laughs> I guess I have to wait for it no matter what. Anyways, get back to golems. And let's see what we're going to need for the core. For the harvest core. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Fill, empty, guard, harvest, fishing, gather, decanting, animated harvester. Uh, so what would cut down trees? Gather, maybe. No, 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 that, that, yeah, this one would be for the second goal, to pick up the wood and then put it into a chest. Keeping an inventory supplied, moving things somewhere else, decanting, guard, harvest, okay, let's read this. Unfortunately, they're not smart enough to replant the crops, that's eh, not a big deal. Blah, 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 yeah, looks like this one's just for crops. So how would we get a golem? to cut down trees for us. Hey guys, I did a little bit of research, and it seems like you need to scan a thing called the Axe of the Stream, Rivers of Wood. So we need to get the research for this thing. Looks like there's a pretty good amount of uh, other like tools here that seem pretty cool. Pickaxe of the Core, Purifying Heat. I don't know. Living Moss, Sword of the Zephyr. Huh, Angry Winds. Shovel of the Earth Mover. These are some really cool looking tools, but uh, apparently you need to make this Axe of the, of the Stream and then, uh, you know, just scan it with the little, what was this little looking glass thing called? Uh, I forgot, it's been a little while. This this little thing right here. <laughs> you need to scan it with that. And that will unlock the the chop animation core, I think is what it's called. Let's actually check. Do we have the modus? Yeah, we're, it looks like it's starting to crystallize modus, so that's good. Anyways, let's see. How are we going to connect these? Modus, instrumentum, and aqua. Ooh. So, instrumentum has humanus and ordo, which I guess we could connected modus because that also requires ordo hmm okay let's get ordo here ordo up here as well maybe get a modus there maybe get another modus <laughs> let's get some uh, air and ordo there you go get some ordo get some modus and get some ordo and get some modus <laughs> so how are we going to connect hmm, air and water Don't that get us anything tempest Ooh, or Tempestas. <laughs> let's, uh, let's get the Tempestas. And boom. Wait, is that not connected? <laughs> oh, I need to get the air first. <laughs> let's connect it like that. There we go. All right. Uh, cheap way of connecting that, but what are you going to do? Anyways, there we go. The axe of the stream. Let's see. How do you craft this? Ooh, looks like it's a zombie on the axe. A little bit of arbor. Nah, I think we have some arbor over here, right? Or did I throw it away? I think we might have thrown it away. So I like, <laughs> I like literally never use it. Uh, I don't think we have any armor. If we did, it'd be like a brownish color, right? I'm pretty sure any armor I would have had, I threw away because I literally never use it. Uh, oh wait, there we go. 17. How much do we need? 17 armor. You know, you only need eight. Ooh. Okay. 16 aqua. Surely we have 16 of that, right? Yep. There you go. Yeah, it looks like all we need is the Great Wood Log, two water shards, a di Ooh. Oh, man, we don't have any diamonds. I might have to go mining real quick. <laughs> uh, probably do that off camera, too, because I, I don't know. I don't want to have, like, a random mining adventure in the middle of this. I, I was already, I was already, like, taking off my initial, like, track of making the golem to make this, this axe of the stream or whatever. So I might have to do a little mini cave adventure here in a second. Off camera. Either way, great wood log. It looks like we need a great wood log and a thalmium max. Do we have great wood uh, already or uh, precantatio? Ooh, four precantatio per thalmium. Looks like we only need four. Oh wait, there's eight right there. That's that's vidium. Ooh, I'm gonna need more precantatio. Got? <laughs> I'm gonna need four more precantatio. Where are we gonna get some precantatio then? Man, we are just taking off course over here. There we go. Basic information. P for Precantatio. There it is right there. But I can't click that. P for Precantatio. There it is. Looks like you get it from... I guess I could throw a shard. There's an extra shard we, we're not really using. I don't know why I just jumped right there. I must have accidentally hit spacebar. <laughs> let's grab a... Let's grab a... A water shard. There we go. You only need two water shards anyways to get the... Is that a, oh wait, we need a little bit of fuel. Uh, charcoal, eh. Let's get some, like, planks. Do we have planks? Yeah, we have some planks. S smelt it with planks. There you go. <laughs> so I guess we don't need the fishing one. 
if we can unlock it with the uh, with a river, the axe of a stream. So that's kind of interesting. Anyways, let's get ourselves some Prey Cantatio. I just water. Oh, it's because <laughs> it was a water shard. That makes sense, right? Anyways, let's wait for the Prey Cantatio. Wait a second. Do you only get how much do you get? Just one? Uh, yeah, looks like you just get one per thing. Okay, so we're going to have to get two, three, four. There you go. Four of these. That way we'll be able to get... Yeah, look at that. We're starting to get some water shards. Oh, wait, no, that was wrong. <laughs> Man, I am, like, off my game today. Oh, jeez. Anyways, let's just wait for those. And then we can make some, uh, some thomium. Let's get ourselves some iron. There we go. We're going to need one, two, three of that. Prey Contatio, we already have that. We can already make some Thaumium right now. Uh, Water of the Forest, we can probably put this up for now. There we go. God, look at those wasted diamonds. I, I kind of feel like, like, cheating in three diamonds and throwing these away just to save myself a mining trip. Because that was an accident after all, right? I don't know. I, I guess I could. It was an accident. Accidents happen, right? So it, it shouldn't be too bad if I cheated that in and just kind of threw away the, the mana diamonds. Because basically... I wasted some mana on, along the way as well, so it's kind of a lose-lose for me right now. Uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, we need water bucket. Uh, bucket of roo. Grabbing you, just one of them. Filling this up. Filling up our call. Oh, it looks like it's already filled up. Okay, whatever. <laughs> filled up to the brim. It looks like it's already filled up to the brim. God. Anyways, we're going to need Precatatio and some iron. We're going to need four of this. One, two, three, four. Boom. Wait, God, missed it again. There you go. <laughs> God, can I jump on top of this pan? Can I get rid of that pan? I like never use it. There you go. Get rid of that trash. There you go. One, two, three, four. And then iron ingot and thomium ingot. Noise. Let's go check if our uh, precontation over here is done. And if it is, then I guess we'll be good to go. Let's see. Precontation. There's three, and then we're going to need this fourth one. That's almost done. Come on, precontation. Crystallize. Oh, that one crystallized. I'm gonna need this last, last and final piece. Come on, please do it. Oh, <gasps> not got it, didn't finish yet. <laughs> Go on, break and Oh, there it is right there. Our fourth and final break and shard. Let's go throw it inside of the cauldron. Or I guess a crucible, I guess is what it's called, right? Yeah, crucible. Let's grab this. And let's throw it. One, two, three, four. Iron. And boom. There's our third piece. <laughs> let's get ourselves some sticks. Uh... I think you can craft it in a regular crafting table, right? Yep, there it is right there, the Thaumio Max. So, now we need to go over to our... Wait, do you have to make it in the altar? The artifice, right? Yeah, art artifice. Yeah, you do have to make it in the altar. Ooh. Okay, let's, let's, let's get rid of those things. Let's throw away the mana diamonds. Get three of those. And let's cheat in some regular diamonds. Okay, so where are we going to throw this away into? I guess I could throw it away into this. Oh, wait, I already patched that up. Get? I don't know. Oh, wait. Don't these stem things? Sting, sting berries? Don't those destroy? I don't think so. Get? What can I guarantee destroy? That way no one thinks, oh, he just went back there to get those mana diamonds off camera. <laughs> uh, let, I don't know. Where can I put this? I guess I'll go put it in the river. <laughs> Let's go throw these mana diamonds in the river and then spawn in three regular diamonds. Because if you ask me, eh. Uh, uh, I'd say it's pretty fair. Well, there you go. Three mana diamonds in the river. And it should despawn by the time I actually finish recording. <laughs> so hopefully no one's going to think that I'm just going to go back and grab those again. Because I know sometimes I get comments saying, Hey, you cheated. You're trying to look like a good person on camera. Uh, either way, let's see. How do we do this? You're going to need the... The... Open the land. Yeah, we're going to need to open the land. Enable cheats. Uh, give the Waffle Galaxy... Diamond three. Oh, there you go. Nice. Okay. Well, now we have the diamonds. And we need two two water shards and a great wood. Oh, okay. We have enough aqua. We have enough arbor. Let's go make this. Let's go get ourselves 16 aqua. And there you go. Eight arbor. And I think we're good. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Hold up. Yeah, they have to be in the... Uh, the yeah, that's to be in the jars. Ooh. Okay. So, not a big deal. All we have to do is disconnect that. And just kind of smelt them. Uh, there's armor. Do, do we already have... We have aqua, right? Surely we have aqua. 
Let's go check over here. We just need to. Oh, is that hot? Yeah, yeah, so, uh, that's aqua right there. God, I can't speak English. <laughs> Anyways, let's just wait for the armor to uh, smelt around. Let's get the charcoal. We're hopefully going to get a ton of charcoal here in the future with our upcoming golem fellow. Let's get ourselves an empty jar. And let's fill it up with some barber trash. Is it done? Uh, six, seven, and eight. Perfect. All right, let's go over there. Throw down the arbor trash. And let's go make this axe of the stream. Or Axe of the River, or whatever it's called. Oh, that's beast shit. I thought that was a harbor right there. I was like, wait, what? That's been there this whole time. Anyways, water shards. Get two of those. Great wood log. We need, we're going to need a... Uh, there we go. Uh, backpack. Two water shards. I think that's pretty much it, right? And then we put the put the Thalmium Axe in the middle. And I think that's going to work, right? Where is our wand? There it is. And let's activate it. So we have Aqua. We have the, uh, the Arbor. It should work now. Let's see how how done is that? Yeah, sucked in the uh, sucked in all the water, sucking in the arbor now, and now it's going to suck in the water shards. Perfect. I don't know what the instability. It shouldn't be too unstable, right? Negli <laughs> negligible. Yeah, I basically don't have to worry about the items like falling off the pedestals. And uh, apparently, this is kind of like a lumber axe. There you go. Let's grab that. Yep, there we go. Let's actually read about it. Maybe we're going to use this instead of our lumber axe. By combining Water Shard and Athamia Max, you've created a tool that embodies the aspects of motion and flow. It functions like a normal axe on all materials except natural logs and trees. When used on a block, the uh, axe seeks the furthest block from the same type that is still connected to the block you're attempting to harvest and harvest that one instead. Wait, so if I... Okay, let's go test this out. So if I go cut down a tree, instead of breaking the bottom block, it'll break the top block? So... Instead of being like a lumber axe where it cuts down the whole tree at once, it cuts it down from the top to the bottom. Huh. Interesting. So would this be better for MLG trees like this? Hmm. I don't know. Lumber. I, I, I feel like the lumber axe could be a lot better. Oh, whoa. Huh. Look at this. We're getting some, uh, some wood falling out of the tree. Okay, that's good. Let's keep going. This is an interesting tool. I still, I still think the lumber axe might be better. Is it me or the leaves are decaying faster than a, with a lumber axe? Huh. I guess grab the apples, grab the sapling. We're getting a pretty good amount. Wow, really good amount of saplings. Wow, that's a <laughs> man. I don't think I was, how, I don't think I've ever got that many saplings from one tree. Twenty three. Huh. Interesting stuff. All right. Well, do we have to? I, I think we have the thing in our backpack, right? We just kind of scan it right now. Yep, there it is right there, the thermometer. I could not pronounce that thing for the life of me at the beginning of the series. Scan that, and there you go. Uh, I got a bunch of research and stuff. Let's go see if it's in the Thaumonomicon now. Okay, that's what I read. Yep. Core shop. There it is. Animated lumberjack. So now we can get that one. But it looks like I'm missing a little bit of Mito. So how am I going to get Mito? I don't know what things I'm going to have to combine in the, uh, the research table to get Mito, but let's go get some more Mito. Uh... Where is it at? Oh, whoops. M for me. There it is right there. So it looks like the instrumentum and this messes. Yeah, we can make more. One, two, three. I think is all we needed. And let's unlock the, the, re the not the recipe, but the research. And then, uh, oh, oh, it's, it's not like a research note. You actually uh, unlock it right there. Uh, ooh, ooh, expensive. So we're going to need the axe. Oh, man, I hope it doesn't hold the phone. Three iron axes, 16 instrumentum, 16 armor, 16 uh, mito, and an axe of the stream. Hmm. I hope this doesn't need to be full health, because this thing it has some damage on it. It's, uh, well, it's not telling me how much damage it has, but uh, I hope it doesn't have to be full health. Okay, okay. You know what? This episode's. Starting to get a little bit long, hitting that 20 minute mark. I, I think I might save this for next time. Kind of interesting stuff. We made an axe of the stream, and I guess next time we can finally make the animation core for the golems to actually cut down the trees and stuff. Hopefully we don't need to actually like make another one of these things or like somehow to repair it or something like that. If we do have to repair it, it's probably just a, 
was it like thomium inside of an anvil or something hopefully it's just that because i do have 79 levels might as well use them right but uh yeah thank you guys all very much for watching if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below and if you guys want more of these awesome videos be sure to hit that subscribe button i put my latest videos on our youtube homepage as soon as they come out so you don't miss an episode but until then thank you guys all very much for watching and it looks like these mana pools didn't really fill up too much well i didn't really give the uh, endo flames any like fuel this episode so uh, can't really expect too much from them but hopefully next episode when we finish making our uh, our lumber at lumber a jack and golems hopefully these mana pools will be nice and full and uh yeah thank you guys all very much for watching oh whoops what is that button <laughs> but thank you guys all very much for watching and i'll see you guys here next time with some more of my life all over there